Welcome everyone to this week's edition of Finance on Your Terms. As always, got your two guys here, Mike over here, Danny over there. And this week we're continuing our theme of busting financial myths. I'm doing a different move each time. I'm and that's, feeling it. that's it's good. good. I can't intro it because you're too good. No, it's too um, good. just ridiculous is all it comes down to. So we are busting some more financial myths this week. And uh, Danny, what's the topic? Today's topic is accessibility and, and honestly minimums because yeah. I've, I've heard over and over and over again since I got into this field with you that I, I meet with people, I sit down with them and they're just like, I don't, I don't have enough money to invest. I don't have enough money to be worth your time. And, and there are, I mean, I understand where that perception comes from because there's a lot of firms out there that you have to have a half million dollars for them to talk to you. You have to have a million dollars, two million dollars for them to talk to you. And that's really not why Mike, myself, anyone at Iron Horse Wealth Management is in the business. We're here because we believe in helping people. And so the, the myth that you have to have this large sum of money to benefit from a relationship or working with us, we just totally want to blow that up today. Yeah. Well, and it might surprise you, but actually most of the major brokerage firms nationally and internationally, and some you'll find around town, the advisor doesn't even get paid unless you have a quarter of a million dollars. So how much attention do you think they're going to be paying to you if you come to them with 5000 or, hell, even $100,000, which is a lot of money and very important that you take care of that money. You've got somebody that's going to be caring about it. Yep. Our firm, and again, we're not trying to brag here, we're not trying to do that, because we don't have any minimums in the way that we're pricing ourselves, which we talked a little bit about pricing last time, is that it doesn't matter whether you've got $100 or $100,000, the way we're pricing ourselves, that $100 person is getting the same amount of attention from us as the person with $100,000. Now, we can explain compounding and all things of that and why we want to grow that account, but growing that account has nothing to do with, hey, we're, we're only getting paid when you get to a certain level or we're only going to pay attention to you because you're at that certain level. Exactly. So keep one of that my, in mind. Yeah, one of my favorite things about Iron Horse and what we do is the clients that we're working with are getting the same level and care and the same portfolio management that those clients with a million, two, three, four million dollars have. Yeah. And that's just what we've tried to do by setting up an efficient business practice yep. and, and, and the way, again, that we're pricing it, you're not getting um, screwed by random fees that, you know, your half of your account's going away just because it's a standard dollar amount versus right. the percentage of this or feeling that. So, uh, again, I, we've said it over and over, ask the questions, ask the questions. and realize that, uh, that zero minimums to us means, uh, is very important because we don't care what your situation is, we don't care if you're just starting out or have accumulated some money and just don't know what to do we want to help and that is one threshold that we know we can hopefully provide the education and help you need no matter what that uh, what that level is right on so if you have questions about your finances even as mike said you got a hundred bucks you're, you're looking to get started i've got a client fresh out of college um, that they started with a hundred dollars and i love working with that kid because he's in yeah he's thinking about his future it's we have people awesome. throwing in 25 bucks a month yep. <laughs> seriously yeah so reach out uh let us know how we can help Share the share this uh, post. If you have questions, leave it in the comments. Share it with your friends. Uh, and again, we're more than happy to help in any way we can. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next week.